notice this guy is rotating over here. And I hear somebody flying. And he's coming up our ladder. Go ahead and take that guy out here. Watch this guy rotate with no plates. Take that guy out there. The zone is going to end somewhere over here. I just saw a red dot over here. That's why I really don't like this, this build. I feel like it's super, like, it's really not that good. Get that All right. Spin and finish up. We're I am three. recording. This is gonna be a, this is gonna be an interesting drop. This is gonna be an interesting little drop here. Came down. We are green I have a feeling it's gonna so end somewhere up, uh, like shoots. over here. Going to the war zone. Mm -hmm. Rules of engagement. I have a feeling it's gonna end somewhere Weapons in this general vicinity, threats. or even maybe this area because it just likes to end there. I think what I'm gonna try and do. Let's roll. Is I'm gonna try and go for my cash route here. Now, hopefully Battle nobody's Royale. seen that video in this lobby, because if they have, then that's not good. Nobody's really going to land out. Like, nobody's going to really land out here. So this is where the first one is. An enemy squad's hunting you. Stay sharp. They got our cluster. That way we can run a little bit quicker. I don't believe anybody came over here. We're going to finish the route over here. We are tracked. Okay, so our bounty is coming from over here because when we were looking at the mini map, or should I say when we were looking at the map when we were flying in, there was actually a bounty over there. So we know that our bounty is gonna be coming from that direction. And there's a guy flying in here we just saw. And we can hear him based off of the proximity chat. He is running proc chat, turn that, turn that off. Loadout drop headed your way. Oh, my gun is on. I don't know why my gun was on single fire, single fire but yeah, we basically just used our ears there to figure out that he was there. All right, we're going to get our loadie. We almost have enough for our shelf res. Let's go and put this straight up. We got a plate box, some money. I think we have enough for a self now. All right. And I tell you what, because I don't want to really be tracked here, and I know exactly where this guy is coming from, I actually just make my way towards him. All right, so he tracked us from over here somewhere. Let's see if we go. Oh. All right, him there. The Boom, that's our bounty. Go. We're no longer tracked. Medical vest, take that. I will stow the muni for the bomb drone. Light up all the way. Okie dokie. All right, we're going to take this Hummer here. I'm going to actually go pick up a Bounty because I want to get some bread. Also, take note, there's a loadout chest right here. Just in case we, for whatever reason, like die or something and we need to come back and get our loadie. Okay, we, we actually see a guy in front of us You got there. a loadout drop inbound. I'm going to smoke push to this guy just because I don't know if he knows that I'm here or not. You got gas inbound. Safe zone relocated. Take this guy out. This guy has absolutely no idea that we were here. Oh, right in front of us. And he absolutely dunks on us. I had the wrong gun out there, unfortunate. That's why I really don't like this this build. I feel like it's super like at anything not close range, it's like it's really not that good. Alright. We smoked that guy. Loadout box here. Get our loadie. Now this might not be our best loadie. We actually see him here. Crack him. You have a smoke grenade to work with, so I'm gonna go ahead and pop that. Yep, and he's gonna take that zip out of here. But I'm not convinced that he's just gonna leave us alone. Oh, all right, he's gonna leave us alone. That guy is probably a big robot and he has no idea what he's doing. Actually, I think I'm gonna sit here because I think this guy wants this bounty. Yep. Free kill for us. Bounty targets marked. Kill them all. Take this herbal gas mask there. Make sure you guys are looting the medicine cabinets. Oh, and the regular boxes because now we have another gulag. Now we can run around with a little bit more confidence. We can run around with a little bit more confidence here. 
We have our bounty on a... I don't know if that was the guy who killed us or not. And I went ahead. Okay. And All bounty, bounty targets are KIA. Over here. Well done. And I just saw somebody in front of us here as well. All right. I'm not sure who that guy is. He's not going to... Oh, my Lord. All right. Well, this guy is just rolling here. Okay. That guy is just absolutely throwing. I'm gonna go ahead and take that guy out. I do still believe there's a guy in here. I think he just popped up in that uh, mosquito Fire drone, so I think he's just sitting in a corner somewhere in there. I'm gonna go ahead and loot this guy because he just did the black site and he might have some goodies. Let me see, does he have an advanced though? I'm not sure if an advanced pops out of these anymore, but why not? So as we can see, this guy actually just popped open the, uh, the mosquito drone here. So I'm pretty sure he's close. And we see another guy floating to us. So this guy is somewhere over here. This drone's gonna come and blow me up. I don't really know where this guy is at. I believe this guy is back on his loot. Yeah, this guy's yes, back on his moving. loot. We're gonna take a nice heady here. Try and get some opening shots on him. He is firing back. Something with a glint. I'm not really too sure exactly what that is. See his glint here. He's gonna run inside, which means we can try and reposition while he's doing that. And there we go and take that guy out. Unfortunately, he wasn't very good. Which is a fortunately, he wasn't very good. All right, we're just gonna take some time here. I'm actually rearranging this bag here. I'm gonna drop the mask. That way, it's in my first inventory. So I don't have to scroll so far. And I still believe there's a guy over here just just sitting in a corner. Like honestly. I 100% believe that there's just a guy somewhere here sitting in a corner, just absolutely scared out of his mind. So I tell you what, we're gonna actually we're gonna go, we're gonna sit over here and we're gonna pop some UAs actually. Get some intel on what's going on here. All right, so we see a prox mine on the buy here, which means let's assume that there's somebody here. Let's try and jump on the freaking car. Take this clear really slow because we don't know exactly where anybody is at. Could just be somebody just tossed it here and and maybe it's just left over here so we're gonna just shoot it i'm gonna smoke it just in case because there might be somebody here all right so it looks like this guy probably just popped it the guy that's in this top left building here he's probably the one who popped it gas is inbound marching a new safe zone and it looks like he's pushing up on us he's gonna have height on us here but i tell you what we're gonna reposition to where we actually don't give him height but he's got a pretty good little heading here not gonna matter he thinks he has the advantage even though we do because we have the advanced av and we're gonna go ahead and take him out there i thought he was gonna be playing behind this little wall here but okay so jailbreak imminent as well which means a lot of people are gonna be coming back i've got three spectators personally already Heads up. we're gonna go from jailbreak 20 to 37 people which is kind of insane but we get the circle shift, so what I'm actually going to go ahead and do is I'm actually going to play up here. I'm Enemy soldier play up here. That guy timed out. There's so many people floating in the air right now. You got gas moving in. So we know that there's another guy over here somewhere because he got killed. Jailbreak is insane. I, I honestly don't know why it's in this in solos so often mm. and if i had my sniper class or anything like that i'd actually just like betty up like on the stairs on the ladders and stuff so nobody could just push me for free but i do not have them i don't really want to spend the money to get them either because i do have a deployable buy which we can use for possibly some later plays if need be if we continue to get the circle maybe we need to do like a gas play or something like that we've got about 15k and a deployable buy which can be used about 30 meters in zone all right so we found him looks like he's in the back over here we're gonna, we're gonna fry him a little bit he's gonna run out not really too sure what's going on here all right we're gonna let him play over there for a little bit we've got a guy pulling up on an ltv we want to take care of he's just gonna stare at us He's gonna fire, fire, fire. Miss every single shot. He's gonna smoke himself because he doesn't know what this LTV is doing. And take some shots with the LTV. Crack that guy in there. If he comes and does a second loop to loop here, we might be able to take him out, but not wanting to. You notice this guy is rotating over here. 
I can't hit the side of a fucking barn. Gas is closing in. Relocating the safe zone. All right, that guy's cracked. I'm under the assumption that he has no plates anymore. And I hear somebody flying. And he's coming up our ladder. Go ahead and take that guy out here. Watch this guy rotate with no plates. Take that guy out there. Kind of keep a, an eye on our surroundings here. We actually we actually get this zone pool a little bit. See a guy rotating on the field here. Live thing him just in case he's smoked. Take him out there. Easy peasy. And right now we're basically just kind of playing position here. We're not necessarily like super kill hungry or anything. I mean, we've got 12 kills already. You can kind of see. Um, and we've been kind of floating around the same area the entire map. And we don't really need to run Nine too left. far just Keep because the pressure like the zone is going to end somewhere over here. I just saw a red dot over here in this barn area somewhere. Means that there's somebody there. I'm going to kind of try and keep my eyes open here. That way I don't get ran up on or snuck up on or anything like that. gonna kind of try and bide our time here just let everybody else fight we don't need to really do anything we don't need to push or kind of force fights anything like that we're just trying to go for the win here and i am just trying to keep my eye on this little kind of barnish area just because i know that somebody shot in there earlier there's gonna be a lot of people fighting across the water here now we're gonna just kind of wait for this zone pull here i believe that was him right there yep you that got guy's gonna be just kind of chilling there. Relocated. We get to rotate down here to the buy. I'm not gonna move just yet because we're relatively clear over here. I'm gonna kind of wait till the zone kind of pushes me down there. That way I can actually try and like force and like hold this guy on the right as well. That's a really good heady that he's got there. So I'm gonna just try and not I'm gonna make sure I'm just basically not gonna go down to this guy off like a snipe or something like that. Just because uh one shot snipers are so strong. So we see a guy in the water here. You're losing ground. Move it. The main point of me not going just yet, obviously, is because this is kind of the same height as that building. Kind of the same height as that building. Okay, so this guy pushed out. I'm gonna crack this guy. Down that guy. Try and double nade it. Hopefully them that fools him. Let's fool him because I'm the goat. Only five people left. Guy's fighting at the buy already. I'm gonna go ahead and actually I'm gonna parachute because I believe that was the only guy on my side. Guys pushing out, not sure exactly what's going on there. I'm gonna turn around and just kind of make sure that nobody is coming from my back here. You know, one guy's in here. I'm gonna pop a muni for some more frags. I didn't yeah, hear him run out, in. so I'm gonna try and make sure that you got a frag in there. Okay, he was still in there. There's gotta be a couple of people in the water here, or just kind of hiding. Okay, someone just Someone just somehow flew in and dove in the water. Not really too sure how that happened. Only three people left. I see this guy's arm here. He's gonna mortar me. Yes, I'm gonna nade him and chow him. Now I'm gonna take my inside build here. And I believe we know that most of them are by the water here. I'm gonna pop my armor box so I don't have any. Rearrange my bag here because I've got my mobile buy. There could be somebody in here, but I'm not 100% sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and chow him. Once this mortar is done, I'm going to head back up to the roof because that's high ground here. I believe I just heard somebody under me. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to cluster this because I believe there's a guy under the dock. Solid copy. Mortar strike on the way. And we're going to see. We're going to see how this works here because I believe... I believe that... Yep. Okay. So I cracked a guy over there on my cluster. Yes, closing in. Get Hopefully this cluster can like maybe kill this guy or something because that would alleviate a lot of issues. Okay, so I downed him. Okay, that's him right there. And now I personally believe that the last guy is under me. I'm going to put on my gas mask here. And I'm going to actually just kind of play gas a little bit here. Because I personally think he's under me. And if he doesn't have a gold mask, then he's going to have to play. And he's going to have to move before I do. Also, what I'm going to do here is if he's not under me, which honestly, it's kind of seeming like he might not be under me. I'm going to just go ahead and I'm going to use this zip here. And I'm going to rotate the smoke this here. I'm going to rotate all the way into cover. I don't know where this guy is. All right, I'm going to pop this mobile buy here. Friendly buy station deployed. Oh, I see. Wait. No, that's not him. All right, he could be on Deployable that buy station. Or, ready. or what's most likely happening is he's in the gulag. Okay, he's not the Gas is moving in. New safe zone located. Okay, so he's under me. Copy that. UAV online and opening the air. He is somehow under me. Finish your mission. Take him down. I see him on my UA, but I'm 
I have no idea how this, like, where this guy's at. I think this guy might be under the map. Yeah, okay, so this guy's under the map. So I've got 14k to try and play with. He hasn't shot me. He hasn't shot me, which means the... Okay, so he PA'd now. I might go down to this. I'm not sure. Okay. I'm going to have to use this buy. I'm going to have to use this buy here to try and out, out heal him. Buy a gas mask here. Okay. All right, he died to his own, so... Good it looks work. like he wasn't really that prepared for that um to try and get an easy freaking win like that freaking idiot but um all we were all we were gonna have to do there essentially is just keep buying gas masks over and over again and just hope and just hope that we got like that we had the most like preparation in that um i guess he was just under the under the map or something trying to get free wins like an idiot so but anyway that's kind of like like my thought process in well, how well, to kind of well. play the game in that we circle um, just kind of giving you my thoughts you on, on down everything that i was trying to do so hopefully did. it was kind of informative and you guys you know got a glimpse inside you the mind of evil. how exactly i like to play these games no rest for the win